Hello everyone, it's Patty Behan, and thank you for joining me in the studio today. In this video, I'm going to show you the magical properties of Ranger's Holographic Embossing Powder. So let's get started. All right, first I wanna tell you a little bit about our Holographic Embossing Powder. It has a clear base and there's these iridescent crystals in here that as you melt it, First, it's like a greenish yellow, then the longer you heat it, it'll turn to orange, and then if you heat it even longer, it gets to be like a violet color. So let me show you what that looks like. And I also have here an, a clear ink pad and a stamp, and I'm working on Distress Black Matte Heavyweight Cardstock. So first thing we want to do is ink up our stamp. I'm just going to stamp it in the center here. And then we're going to pour the powder over top. Remove the excess. Let me get this corner over here. And I'm gonna put this aside for now. Put this back in the drawer. And I'm going to stamp our next one. I'm doing this so that um, we'll heat them up all at the end and I'll show you the differences. Stamp it in the middle. Pull this over top. That's number two. And one more to go. You can leave these sit here for however long once you put the embossing powder over the wet ink. ready to emboss. So I'm going to take our first one and I'm going to heat it up and I won't be able to talk over the embossing tool so I'm just going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm just going to start and heat it up, stay in one place and once I see it turn turn to the the greenish yellow color I'm going to move move the heat tool until I finish the whole leaf. closer and this is what it looks like when you just heat it up till it starts to melt. Okay we'll put that aside. Now next I'm going to heat this one up a little bit longer and then you'll see that it, how it's going to start to turn to orange. <laughs>
closer so that you can see how it now has like an orange tint to it. And then for the last one, we'll heat it even longer and it'll turn to violet. so that you can see how it changes colors and maybe we can try and zoom in here to so that you could see it better and another thing that would be cool is that um, you can try to like get different looks in the same same stamped image I tried to get like a little bit of the green and the orange and the purple so you get this cool all different colored leaf okay so now let me just show you some more examples that we have here so I'm not sure the best way to show you this so maybe I'll fan this out and then I'll put them down. So we made a trio of cards here, going from the green to the orange to the violet here. And that's a great idea that you can do. And this is a smaller stamp and it still has a lot of impact. And then we have another trio here using a different stamp. And we use a metallic cardstock to highlight the color in the stamp. And that's really pretty as well. And then here we just had, we made a Christmas card using just the green color and just stopping there. And then we have a patterned stamp that we used, a background stamp, and that's another fun look. And then die cut it out. And then here we did an outline stamp. And let me see if I could get the colors. And that's also another great fun look. So I hope you'll give this a try and play around with it. You may come up with other ideas of how to use this powder. So thanks for watching. And if you'd like to see more videos about our embossing powder, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.